one man, one game. Welcome to another episode of League of Legends, The Race to Gold. Hello there, Wonder Guy here with another episode of The Race to Gold. And I am bringing out the classic, the one, the only. Debonair Jace. Because I haven't played Jace in fucking forever and I was against a Malphite and all you can do against a Malphite is some sick damage. That was over 30 damage as I just casually walk away from this Malphite and Zack gank because you know, Jace is quite a quick chap. This was the most boring ranked game I have ever played. I couldn't do anything to Malphite and all that would happen is this. Flash past that. Oh, relax. It's all fine. Oh my god, they actually hit me with stuff. Oh, and the knock up. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's not as if I'm just walking away. Oh. Oh wait, no, I definitely did exactly what I just said. I finally had enough of this Malphite and decided to try and do some damage to him. As you can see, it went incredibly well. So well, in fact. So well. That I didn't even kill him. So, oh my god. And this is how boring this game was. Yeah, that's how I'm a team player. It also had turned out that the Fizz on the enemy team had gone AFK, which I don't know why he was winning quite a lot mid. And we're pushing the tower here. And by pushing the tower, I mean I am pushing the tower. Ignoring everything else that's going on. Because the tower needs to die. Now, eventually, once everyone starts this fight, I get in and I do some work. Crushing the Zack, forcing him into this blobular, blah, 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 whatever. I want to call that fucking shit again. As I flash forward from Malphite, leaves him exposed. There's a little cheeky knock to the side with Thresh, followed up in a dash. And picking up the Zack. Now, would I have got the Malphite? Yes, I would have, if creeps weren't a thing. But no matter. After finally getting on the scoreboard with some kills, I decided it was probably about time that I got a death as well. And that's why I was so far up. Honest, it's to make you feel like I had a chance of losing this game. It's to have a, a more rounded feel. That's what everyone was doing here. We were all dying to make it seem like we had no chance and that we were coming back. As they decided to completely ignore me, I very sneakily snuck around doing a ton of damage to Thresh, leaping on him and punching him in the face. And then again, using Jace's magical powers to just walk away from anything happening to you. But yes, uh, unfortunately, having someone AFK kind of sucks. And I do feel for the enemy team, I do feel. I do feel, and I did report the Fizz. And everyone should report the Fizz. And if you play with that guy, you should call him a cunt. But I'm so close to the next promotion. So very close. 